All right, so I am in the Home Goods parking lot, about to go into Home Goods to see what they have. Wow, they're looking at me. This is the awkward part of vlogging because people will look at you while you're in your own car. Kind of weird. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna be vlogging. I'm going to the container store in Home Goods to see if I can find some product to organize the cabinet under my sink. It is, it's a hot mess. It, it's, it's a hot mess. So actually, let me show you guys, wait. All right, so <laughs> I think you guys really don't wanna see this, but okay, here we go hot mess I mean there's stuff in here that I'm not even really using anymore I mean some of the stuff just has to go I mean I don't know if you guys can see this but it's just stuff everywhere so I am going to see what I have see what I want to keep um, and then I'm gonna go get the products for it and take you guys along with me so Stay tuned. I am at Home Goods right now. I'm gonna go there before I go to the container store because I know I can probably find everything I need in the container store. But sometimes Home Goods have what I need for a cheaper price. So um, since I am shopping for myself, I am going to go in here and look for products. So my budget for this project is sixty dollars. Hopefully I can you know hit below sixty. Um, but no more than 60. I'm just organizing my uh, cabinet under my sink. So I'm not really trying to spend a lot of money. So that's why I'm going to check out Home Goods first before I check out the container store. And let's see what I can find. So this may be good for something. I don't know. Maybe sponges or I don't know what could go in here. But hmm, $8. I don't know if I want to do that. I don't really have much that I can use to organize. Oh, wait. Hmm. I might be able to use this for something. I think this would be good for something, but I'm not sure. It has a lot of scratches on it. I actually like this one better. I like how clean this one looks. It's the same price as the other one. It's not all marked up. Just store like sponges, washcloths. I don't know, I like this. So I'm just gonna get one of these. So there's a lot of baskets to choose from, but I kind of want something that's stackable to optimize the vertical space. <sighs> These are kind of cute. I don't know. What do you guys think? Y'all, it is so crowded in here. It is so crowded. I can't really find anything. This is the only thing I found. So I'm probably going to go to the container store soon. Oh wait guys, so these, actually, this may work for something. I kind of like this better than this. This is only $10. I don't know. There are some options here. Okay, wait, we might get lucky. Stacking tote. I think I'm going for more of an acrylic look, but this is really nice. So I know these are for shoes, but this would be nice to do like gloves and um, sponges and all that good stuff in here. I'm gonna get this and put these two back. I think I'm gonna get another one. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet, but if it doesn't work, then I will take it back. You guys, <laughs> it it was way too crowded in there. I could barely do my shopping. <laughs> um, I guess that's a good thing, right? Um, for business. But I am going to head to the container store to get the rest of the items. 
Um, and let's see if I can stick to budget. <laughs> This location is so cute. We come here all the time, but just look how cute it is. for my budget. I guess that's what that looks like. Really nice. Maximizes a lot, maximizes a lot of the vertical yeah, space. Like I think I may get this Lazy Susan. That's what it could look like. 18 inches. Good price point. Kind of like these too. These are really affordable. Very cute. But I'm going for more of a acrylic look. And you guys, these are really good things to, to organize under your sink. If you kind of really need a lower budget, I love these. And they're only $4.99. You can get different colors. Like I said, I want to do more of a acrylic look. I guess the clear would work. I may get one of these, I'm not sure. We'll see. These baskets are really cute too. I'm gonna do this for a client. So let's, yeah, I think I'm just gonna call it a day and get to organizing. Y'all, y'all saw the last clip. What, what did I say my budget was again? So my budget for this project is sixty dollars. Hopefully, I can you know hit below sixty. Yeah, it, I definitely exceeded my budget. At least about thirty dollars. That's unacceptable. So I'm probably going to end up taking something back, like at least something. I mean, it's a small sink. So not a lot can fit under there anyway. I mean, usually and typically when I'm organizing, I'm going to overbuy only because I want to make sure I have everything I need so I don't have to keep going back to the store. Um, this is such a small space anyway to where I'm going to probably take something back. So, But I'll let you guys know the final total at the end of the video. Like, I don't want to spend $100 for this. That's just too excessive, even for me. Right now, I am on the way to Starbucks really quick. I'm gonna get me something refreshing. I don't like coffee. Um, I only go to Starbucks for tea, um, and they have really good like refreshers. Um, so I'm gonna grab me one. I feel like Stout by Casanova right now. Which, if you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm gonna plug her YouTube channel right here. Um, but I feel like her right now because she always vlogs her Starbucks trips, but she does like home decor, uh, she does home organization too. But she's like, she is the stuff when it comes to home decor, like, she's that one. But she's a really good interior designer, I really love her. So, I'm not gonna get the dragon fruit like she always does, I'm gonna try it one day though. Like, I really do want to try it. Um, but I think I'm going to get a strawberry refresher, so. Hey, can I get a strawberry refresher, medium size, please? I'm so excited about this. I'm treating myself today because I haven't had one in a minute. Hey, good. Okay. Here you go. You doing anything? Um, no. 
I went to the container store today. That's about it. At the container store? Yes. That is exciting. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, it is exciting. I love the container store. Yes. Everybody's obsessed. I don't have container store money, but I like it. Hey, on the budget. That's my memo. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Thank have you. A good rest of your day. You too. product placement. I really thought that I was going to take these two back because I was so in love with the items that I got from the container store, but I'm going to have to take the Lazy Susan back. I'm so sad. Oh, I'm so sad. It's just not functional for the space. Um, as you can see, the product kept hitting these two, um, the pipes under the sink and yeah, I, it just wasn't functional. So I think these just work better um, for my situation. It's still aesthetically pleasing and it's nice and it's the acrylic clear look that I was going for. Um, but yeah, the, the Lady Susan unfortunately has to go. My sink is just way too small for this, but I still love this product. And if you have pipes that are higher in your sink, I definitely recommend uh, purchasing the Lazy Susan. And here is the finished product, guys. Okay, so I am in love. I um, labeled these with my chalk marker. Um, acrylic is really easy to write on with chalk markers. And then I just did something simple with these. So I used my label maker uh, to label these. Uh, and this one's labeled too, you can't really. Well, yeah, you can see it a little bit. Um, but I really love this. Um, it's simple. It's not anything too intricate, but now I can kind of see what I have. And I usually get some disinfectant wipes, so I left a little space for those. Um, they come like in threes, so I feel like this would be enough for us to just place them there, but it looks so nice. I love this. and. Honestly, this is gonna make my life a lot easier. All right guys, so that concludes this video. I'm actually gonna place the final total right here. Definitely want to be a little bit below my budget, but like I said, I had to take the Lazy Susan back, which you can see. <sighs> kind of sad about that. Um, I really like the Lazy Susan product. Um, but you know, hey, it just didn't work for my space. Be sure to like this video if you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe and click that bell notification if you wanna receive notification posts in the future for future content. Bye guys.